Take a drive down McCullough Street near Druid Hill Park, and you'll notice a pack of elephants hanging out in the grass. But don't, don't, don't be alarmed. They didn't break out from the zoo. No, their artwork designed by the Mandaman community to make that area a better place to drive around and live. ABC 2 News' Megan Knight has more on this colorful pack of pachyderms. Building life-size replicas of elephants is no small feat. Another inch, and you're good. The mama elephants and their babies aren't just brilliant pieces of art. They're part of a grand plan to spruce up the Mandaman community. They, the community is the expert. They know what they want. Deborah Patterson of Art Blocks is leading the project. Using a process called creative placemaking, she collected input from neighbors about what they wanted to see in this space. So it's a bottom-up grassroots process as opposed to old-school top-down where we come in and say, this is what you need. Elephants were chosen for their kind, loving, and wise personalities. Local artists like Barbara Thompson helped design these massive structures. Part of the idea of the elephants was to make something that would remind people of the idea of going a little slower on the road. One side of each animal features artwork made of recycled materials like petals and signs. The other side is the gallery with mosaics handmade by people in the neighborhood. If you provide an opportunity for people to create who don't usually get that opportunity, it is, it's incredibly uplifting, empowering. Creating a space that symbolizes the heart of this community piece by piece. In Baltimore, Megan Knight, ABC2 News.